Hi and welcome to your next section in Computer Science for Everyone. In this section we're going to talk about binary and bits, bytes and converting from text to binary. Let's start with a decimal to binary conversion. This is a small table that will help you see the pattern between a decimal and a binary conversion. We can see first that 1 in decimal equals 1 in binary. 2 in decimal equals 1 0 in binary. 4 is 1 0 0. So this is a small pattern here that we could notice by ourselves. If 1 0 is 2 and 1 0 0 is 4, it is likely that 1 1 0 is going to be 6 because it is the addition of the numbers. We start counting from the right. So the right is 1, the next one is 2, the next one is 4, the next one is 8, the following one is 16. So indeed, if we have 1, 0, 0, and we add 1 to it, it comes here at the very right, and that would be 5, and indeed we can see 5 here. So 1, 0, 1 would be 5. Let's explain it further, don't worry. So this is what this means. Let's say we have the binary number 111010. The number at the right is 2 to the power of 0. And then the number increases as we go to the left. So the next one to the left is 2 to the power of 1, then 2 to the power of 2, 2 to the power of 3, 4, and 5. In this case, because we only have six numbers, then we start at 0, and then we go all the way up to 5. If we calculate these powers, 2 to the power of 0 equals 1, 2 to the power of 1 is 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. So indeed, we're multiplying by 2 as we go along. If the number is 0, we just ignore it. If the number is 1, we calculate the value and we put it down here. So this is the second number from the right. The value is 2, and because it is a 1, it's actually 2 here. The first one is a 0, so we just ignore it. The next one is a 0, so we just ignore it. And then 8, 16, and 32. So the sum is 32 plus 16 plus 8 plus 2, the total of that is 58. Let's try something then. Binary conversion. The number at the right is 1. The next one would be 0. Sorry, the next one would be 2, but because it's a 0, we ignore it. The next one is 4, because 1, 2, then 4, then 8, then 16, then 32, but we ignore it. 64, but we ignore it. And the last one is 128. So if we were to convert 1001, 1101 into decimal, we end up with 1 plus 4 plus 8 plus 16 plus 128. And the total for that is 157. So 1, 1, sorry, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1 is 157. As we've seen before, one bit is a 1 or a 0, and they join together to form bytes. 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1 is one byte, because one byte is 8 bits. We've seen this in the previous section, so there's not much of a secret to you now. So hopefully this clears some doubt as to how to convert between binary and decimal. And in the next lecture, we're going to see how to convert text to... Um, sorry, binary to text, rather, text to binary as well. So stick with me and let's go into the next lecture.